Hi viewers, welcome to blood test. Today is a topic important for those who are already running a laboratory and those who want to know the cost effective methods of running your diagnostic center while establishing your laboratory. Kindly see this video till the last so that you get all the tips I am going to mention here today to generate more revenue and profit for your diagnostic center. Let's go into the topic most technically advanced machine that is a CLIA machine or the hormone analyzer, immuno analyzer, any, any way you can call it. This is one of the most sensitive machines in your laboratory. If you're running a laboratory, you would know that the most sensitive machine and this has so many parameters involved with it to give a very accurate report. So various brands are there in CLIA machine in that most importantly, you have to see what type of cuvettes these people are using for example one type of machine will have cuvettes in which only a pack of you know five or six will come in a row and it has to be used as a bunch some machines have individual cuvettes then you're going to use the machine which has the row cuvettes then you have to be very sure that you load samples five or six so that all the cuvettes are used or you're going to load just one sample and you're going to put that one row the whole five cuvette spaces will be used for that single sample it will go as waste it will use just one cuvette one space will be used and the other five will go into waste whereas when you use a single cuvette type of machines of the clia machine then only one cuvette will be used per sample and there will be less wastage so while choosing the machine only you can choose what type of cuvettes your machine provider is providing as which will you know very well reduce the cost in a uh, newly starting the most important thing you have to see in a CLIA machine is the starter solution which again when you are going to run in batches or you're going to scrub the samples and you're going to run the amount of wastage of the starter solution or the usage of the starter solution is going to be less when compared to using it one by one the third thing you have to see in a CLIA machine is the dilution factor for certain tests like beta HCG, usually dilution is needed. So when loading the beta HCG sample itself, you can also ask for a dilution to the machine so that automatically, you know, less amount of qubit is wasted while running the test instead of finishing one beta HCG. And after that, for the same sample, putting a, you know, putting a dilution, it is going to, you know, uh, use more of solutions. Next important thing about the CLIA machine is that selecting the right pack size of the reagent suppose uh, you are running a laboratory in which you get a lot of thyroid samples you can get even 200 test pack samples whereas for estrogen progesterone and other hormones make sure you if you are a starting medium-sized laboratory you just get the so uh, 50 pack size uh, reagent uh, or else uh, what you will do is it will have a stability of you know once you open the pack of the reagent it will be stable for around some will have a stability of 28 days some will have a stability of around 56 days so once you open from the day of opening the reagent it is going to be valid only till such days so if you're able to use 100 test pack then go for a 100 test pack just for an investment purpose in the starting of your laboratory plus please don't go for a 100 test pack you can go in for a 50 test pack which will going to save a lot of revenue for your laboratory some of the methods in which you can cost control or effectively cost control and increase your revenue or generate more profit from your existing diagnostic business or from the business you're going to start for as a diagnostic center if you have any doubts or if you are interested in establishing your own diagnostic center and would want our help you can write to us at pathlabstartup at gmail.com you can also uh, whatsapp us at the below mentioned number if you like our videos kindly subscribe our channel and also press the bell icon see you tomorrow with another video bye bye signing off dr lalita Center.